So this is a standard old thing. The last time I was here, we were shooting, we were shooting smoke rings out of a box. And you can get any size container. And I'll put some smoke in here. Just had to hit the button. Is it going? Ooh, look at that. I'll fill it with smoke. But it's going to come out a square hole. What's it going to look like? Picture it in your brains. You're 10 years old. And don't worry about this smoke. I looked at the label. It says it's not carcinogenic, but it does have a slight laxative effect. <laughs> so, here we go. But, what? Now, it's, it's, it's round out of square hole. Now you can make this any way you want with an oatmeal box or anything. You shoot smoke rings just like that with a rubber band and trash bag. You're gonna to have to make one of these at home, which you could out of anything. They don't have to be smoke rings this big. But if you'll look very carefully at the hole when they first come out, can you see for a fraction of a second they're square? And then it gets rolled into round? Well, who's doing that rolling? If you do it just right, you'll get a square, square ring. Uh, oh, there, well, square. You see it slightly square when it comes out right there. Right there. Square, and now it's getting round. And somebody's rolling it like rolling clay or something like that, right? And just to sit there and take a, a careful look at this when it's coming out, you say, there, 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 hold it right there, right there, it's square, right? Oh, right, right there, right there, it's square. Half of the discoveries now with exoplanets, or when they're looking for little bitty changes around stars, a little flicker. And scientists have to learn to look for those little bit changes. And you, you have to train your head to do that. And how are you going to do it? That's kind of cool. This is a special announcement to all my friends at Midnight Science Club. And I don't get to say things like this very often, but we had probably the greatest honor given to us recently. We were invited to do a Friday evening discourse, that's a speech, at the Royal Institution of Great Britain. And if you'd like to see it, and experience it, go to the Royal Institution of Great Britain YouTube page, check it out.